Only on to this stretch of beach in suburban North Chicago was supposed to be packed with families for the holiday weekend for the first time in 100 years. But now it's not. CBS 2 Sabrina Franza is live along the lake digging into why Sabrina. The people of North Chicago have been without a beach for nearly a century. It had been closed because the current was just too dangerous. Now, midway through the renovations, they'll have to wait again. Uh, my whole continent sank because we were just, it took so long to happen and then here comes the strike. A labor dispute that started on June 7th means North Chicago's beach won't have July 4th. Unfortunately, a lot of uh, projects have been slowed down because of this. Local 150 of the International Union of Operating Engineers went on strike against three manufacturers for unfair labor practices. The problem here is those manufacturers produce things like sand, necessary for building a $4 million taxpayer funded beach, especially this beach, which for decades was closed for its unsafe swimming conditions, a rip current and sand drop off. And by the time it's finished, it won't be a drop. It'll just be a beach. These rocks also make it safer. They slow down the current with break walls. Rocks are actually able to prevent the rip tides that we have here in Lake Michigan. Work has resumed. It's just going to take longer. Closer to the end of July, maybe the first week of August. Even then, just like in many other parts of the Chicago area, no lifeguards. Uh, swim at your own risk policy. Next year, the Park District tells us they plan to partner with their Navy neighbors at Naval Station Great Lakes, a different solution to the lifeguard shortage. I think this is very likely. A Navy representative, though, told us the opposite, that they don't have enough lifeguards to support their own work unless the tide turns in the next 12 months. I'm just grateful that this is finally happening and that this community and surrounding communities can come here and have good family days and good family vacations. The Park District is planning a big opening celebration on July 30th. They'll hope that people can swim from then for the until the rest of the summer. They're also planning for more upgrades, a playground, picnic stations, as well as concessions, and they're expecting those to be completed by sometime this fall, hopefully by October. Reporting from North Chicago, Sabrina Franza, CBS 2 News.